Hey y'all, it's Nick with the DeCampers. I'm coming to you guys today from Natural Falls State Park here in West Elm Springs, Oklahoma. Um, I recently did a video about how you can uh, do three step rugs for five bucks, and I had somebody comment to ask about, um, jokingly, if now you can show me how to do a cheap patio rug the same way. <laughs> But what he didn't realize was I was actually about to do that. So let's go check out how I've come up with a nice patio rug on the cheap. So first off, here's our spot in Natural Falls State Park, like I just said. <laughs> and uh, it's been raining and everything, so our rugs are kind of wet and yucky. Uh, the puppy's been kind of chewing on sticks and things on them. But so I just want to show you guys uh, kind of our rug evolution here. So if you can see, I mean, like I said, dirty from all the rain and everything. Okay, you can see there's a seam right there. Okay, we started out with this rug. It is uh, 12 foot by 8 foot. Um, and this rug is 12 foot by 15 foot. And these are actually um, purchased from Lowe's. They are outdoor carpet. Let me show you the little pattern. It's, I mean, you can tell how dirty they've gotten in this rain. Um, this rug right here is only like about two weeks old. Um, second camping trip. We took it out last weekend too. Um, super duper soft. Really soft on your feet. We like a nice big rug because we can, you know, just kind of kick our flip-flops off and walk around and it's just great. And the main thing is all this crap on the rug is crap we're not dragging in to our trailer. Things we don't have to sweep them up. But okay, so now this rug, the 12 by 8 that I was telling you guys about, this one we've had probably a year and a half and now let's look at the seam here did you see how on the right the square pattern is a little more prominent than the left just a little little fluffed out on the left here um so now let's look at the back see how the back is rubberized this one you can kind of see the fibers more but i'll tell you what this smaller rug, the 12 by 8 it lives in the back of our truck. I mean, rain, snow, sun, you know, it just lives in the back of the truck. So, for as long as we've had it, it never being put away, it has really held in, I mean, countless camp trips, and um, never mildewed, it always dries out. It hasn't had any kind of a mildew issue. It hasn't had any kind of a fade issue. I mean, look at the colors there. They're the same. Of course, they're both wet. But, uh, you know, no, no sun fade, no mildewing, nothing like that. No kind of discolorization. And like I said, for a very long time, that smaller rug has lived outside. And now our big rug, it kind of just lives in the back of the truck, too. We, uh... You know, our, the truck we tow with is just kind of, that's what its whole purpose is, is just towing and holding camp gear. But, okay, so to the cheap, to the point. So these rugs, like I mentioned, we got them from Lowe's. They're outdoor carpet. Um, they come off, you know, the big rolls that you see in the back. And, like, in the back of the store. And, um, oh, gosh, I'm going to get it wrong on how many linear feet... So, okay, so this one that is 15 foot wide, that's how long the roll is on the back of the store. So you buy it by the foot off of the roll, if that's making sense. Um, so this big one that is uh, 12 by 15 after tax was 109 and the smaller one that is 12 by 8 was about 45 something like that and now you might be thinking okay 109 sounds kind of expensive nick you're supposed to be telling us cheap stuff <laughs> a 
like the step rugs, but if you were to go to Amazon, if you were to go to Camco products, anything like that, to find an outdoor, quote unquote, outdoor RV rug that size, you're going to pay more than 109 bucks, including taxes. I mean, we've all seen those like kind of plastic weaved ones, which I'm not knocking those. Those are nice, but they're not as nice on your bare feet. And I really hate that it rained and this rug is so dirty right now because when it's dry and clean, oh my gosh, it's so nice and so fluffy. But so I would recommend, and this was like, this is kind of the more expensive outdoor rug um, that you could buy by the foot. They have all kinds of outdoor rugs by the foot at Lowe's. Um, way cheaper option than buying a pre-made rug. And what's great is, let's go back over here and look at the one that is old. Okay. This is the cut line. There is no frame. It does not need to be hemmed. You just have Lowe's cut it, and that is it. I mean, you're ready to roll. No fraying, no kind of weird stuff. So uh, I really, man, I just can't think of any more great things to say about it. We just love it. It really extends our setting area, um, you know, keeping the dirt out of the trailer. And I just could not find another rug that I would be happier with. You know that was like pre-made so I would recommend if you want a good rug at a good price I mean you want good quality and size um, go down to Lowe's go check out the, the carpet section they have all kinds of options for outdoor rugs this particular one is one I'd recommend the most just because it's so soft I mean it's like cotton even though it's not cotton <laughs> um, but when you're walking around uh, barefoot at camp it's just so soft, so nice. Like I've mentioned like 10 times now, no mildewing, no discoloration, no fraying on the edges, nothing like that. And I mean, if you look at our older rug compared to the one that we just got two weeks ago, I mean, you really have to have them right side by side to tell that the original one has aged at all. And really the only age is just, it lives outside, we've used it a lot. And so the perfect definition of the little um, textured squares has gotten a little bit fluffier looking, I guess you could say. Not quite defined straight lines, but nothing wrong with it. You still see the pattern just fine. So go check out Lowe's. They've got like the green AstroTurf stuff. They've got this stuff, all kinds of things. A whole lot cheaper than you're going to find, you know, online, Camco products, anything like that. Um, and you know, you, not everybody wants so much rug. You can get it in any size. The rolls on this particular one, like I said, are 12 foot. It's a 12 foot long roll. You buy it by the linear foot, which I'm gonna get it wrong, but it was like, I wanna say it was like six bucks, six, seven dollars per linear foot. So uh, go down to Lowe's guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll try to come up with some more of my cheap tricks. And until next time guys, we are on Facebook as The DeCampers. We are on Instagram as The DeCampers80. If you liked our video and some of our information, please like, please subscribe. We'd really appreciate it. And until next time, see you guys later. Happy RVing.